Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Sea of Stars tonight. With our good friends, Valer and Zale, and our goof-ass warrior cook, Garl. I like Garl. Garl's a good dude. Um, let's continue. Let's see. We got up to the Elder Mist stuff. We did one of the three branches in that dungeon, and we've got two more to do. Two more to do. And then we get to use magic without using magic forever, right? Um, oh, look at this. This is fancy. Hey, Firetron, how you doing? Let's see. Ya. Uh, see, I was hoping for like a secrety secret off the sides here. No such luck. That's alright. That's alright. Looks like we got an elevator. Maybe. Maybe we'll get to ride that elevator. What do we got here? The switch? Oh no, is this a water temple raise and lower the shit here? Okay, three questions. How, how well have we learned? Which one regenerates MP while attacking, obviously? <laughs> Duh. Yeah, hey, there we go. Oh, is that it? Okay, we have to find other spots to do that then. Um, I'm glad I had to stay late at work to a customer looking at oh, that's that's a bummer. Sorry to hear that. But hey, at least the day's over, right? You're back home and chilling and doing what you need to do. That is the name of the school we went to. Uh, Solstice Elementary. Oh, maybe. Like, maybe they had an elementary school that we went to, but the cutscenes didn't show. But no, we went to Zenith Academy. <laughs> like, why is it out of the question that they maybe had an elementary school as well? It very well could have been an elementary school. Mushroom Scramble. Not a big fan of mushrooms, but I'm sure in terms of the game it's probably delicious and does a lot. Actually, I'm curious if we look- oops, not that. Um, where's our, like, menu menu, though? There it is. Um, recipes. Does it tell us what it does? Yeah, 35 HP and 5 MP. That's not bad. Not the worst. Not the worst. Um... Oh, right. Just drop down here. That's the third one. <laughs> A very important solstice warrior is to destroy dwellers who become vulnerable during which natural phenomenon? Um, the e <laughs> Hold on. The eclipse. See, we pay attention. We pay attention to the lore enough to know that we can solve a multiple choice test here. But we did it. I guess that was the, the the wisdom test, huh? And, you know, basic platforming, spatial reasoning. Oh, that's a big boy. Alright, the third bit. Ah, oh, I see that one's a bit hidden. Oh, but hey, look at that. That one's not hidden. Give me. Shiny Pearl. What was that worth? 20 bucks? Or 20 moon dollars? Or 20 solstice finance representative things? Okay, this one's definitely more of the spatial reasoning bit, huh? I wish we could get, like, first strike stuff. Kind of a missed opportunity there, honestly. Uh, well, it's not gonna matter which one we hit. That one's gonna go first regardless. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to get on our mustard with the timing here. So, alright, Zale. You do that, and you attack this guy. There we go. Gotta watch whoever does the little huh animation, that's who they're attacking. Alright, Garl, beat the shit out of that one. Or beat enough of the shit out of it that we can uh, get the stuff, you know? And we'll. I guess we'll do this one. Doesn't matter. Either way, it's gonna be an additional attack from that fucker. Oh, 
very short one. Nice. Three items. 72 experience. Oh, just three berries. Okay, I see. Oh, okay. We got some bridges. And then there's the thing. Very good, very good. Alright, still relatively linear, but... A neat, neat use of the space, yeah. So what is this Megazord itself into here? That we are undoubtedly going to have to fight, right? Like, that's the thing. Let's make sure we're healed up before we do, right? And save, naturally. Okay, now we're ready. Last chance to prepare. Do you feel ready? Fuck yeah. I mean, it's it's good that they kind of give you that prompt again as well. It's just like, hey, you remember what you're doing, right? Finished preparations. Yeah, we sure did. We got the three pieces of the Megazord or whatever. Let's, let's see what we got. Use of spells is now allowed. Hooray! Which means we can... Host the shit out of this idiot once we gather the live mana. Whoa, whoa, damn. Okay. He glue up quick. Alright, uh. Oh, boy. Well, alright. Let's see. First of all. That's interesting. Okay, so we can. Oh, he's got. Only two targetable bits, or is there three? Oh, there's two. Okay. Well, I think I would prefer to probably knock the shit out of his sword. And that's probably gonna be like, hey, uh, get the magic bits. Yeah, get the magic bits and then do a big bit and then, yeah, alright, let's use Zale next. We're gonna have him do, well, we're gonna boost, right? And we're gonna have him do Sunball. Right on the S word. That seems good. Bam! 58! Wow! Good numbers. Oops, we kind of duffed that one up, though. Okay, only 18 on the S word now. Alright, Garl, go get it! Oh, well. Yeah. You know what? We'll just get it out of there. There we go. Now we got lots of magic bits. Hey, game over. How you doing? Good to see you. And then Zale can be like, yeah, I'm a, oops, there we go. I'm a, just mm, attack the shit out of the main bit here. 30, that's pretty good for a normal attack. Garl, I'll have you kind of do it too. Get more tiny magic bits. And then if we've got enough, oh geez, sorry, Garl, I wasn't paying attention. Got enough, we can boost a Moonerang here. And then, bim, boom, bam. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Ah! <laughs> Twenty seems pretty good. Um. Okay. And uh. Garl, why don't you uh? Why don't you heal up a bit there, bro. Forget what the uh. Get uh, the timing on that one was. Okay. Zale. That normal attack that you flub the timing on. Oh, good block there. That's good shit. Oh, and I just used my moon bits too. Crapadoo. Uh, well, do we have any uh, MP restoring things? There, berry jam. Uh, does that that uses my turn though? Probably. Um, can somebody else go? Yeah, here. Uh, Garl, you. Uh... Use the berry jam on Valer. To give her enough moon bits, or moon moon points, magic points, to do the moonerang yet again. 
And well, hell, we'll, we'll do a boost on it as well. Just wait for a week or so on vacation. Good to be back to a brand new game. Well, hope you enjoyed your vacation. I hope it was relaxing, restful, awesome, any number of positive adjectives for you. But welcome back, all the same. Uh, all right, let's let's do the moonerang again. I think we had twenty last time. That was pretty good. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Ah! <laughs> well, we popped the chivo for it. We're getting. 25! 25 Moonering, Dillabox. Oh, and then he's got a... Okay, no, we we busted his little attack thing now. That's good shit, that's good shit. There we go. Really taking it to him. Oh, his, his S-word is feeling better. Oh, only 55, that's fine. We can make that work. Um, Carl, why don't you go first? 16 is not bad. All right, I'll grab a little bit of that and go. Oh, I wanted to double tap that, but that's all right. All right, how much does that have now? 22. I think we can do that with a Zail bit, right? Um, attack, sword. Ow, oh, one short. That's all right. Okay, good block, Zail. Oh, he's doing a thing now again. Oh, and we don't have enough. Uh, <laughs> uh, wait, how much is... Oh, we need six. And I'm out of MP shit. Um, but we can combo. Yeah. Combo with, uh... Well... Same stuff, huh? Well, that attack's gonna do some damage, I guess. That's alright. That's fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Each regenerate three MP. Okay, that seems good. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, let's beat the Shadow Center one, I guess. Oh. Oh, 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 that, okay. I need to see. Um. Oh, crap. Uh. Well, I don't want him to do his main attack, so we're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna not let him do his main attack. In the hopes that, uh... That's le worse than the sword counter. Oh, that's right! I forgot it bounced between them. That's probably even better. Nice. Okay, that's serviceable. Okay, um, we'll grab those. And he's, he's doing a little heavy breathing there, so we could be, uh... We could be getting close. Um... Yeah, you nourish Zale there. Oh, what's the fucking combo for that? Oh, well, he almost got back to full regardless. Okay, and then... slap a -do. Yeah, fuck you, Elder Mist! That was a pretty good fight. Pretty good fight, and we got 200 some XP. And this guy's like, ah, oh, shit. How could these young adults beat the fuck out of me? Uh, bright future, yada yada. Solstice Warriors, hello, yeah, alright. What about Garl, though? They use the upgrade to Warrior Chef instead of Warrior Cook. Prophecies, and then we go out into the world, and then we have an adventure. Nice. Okay, we did it. Fucking did it. Did that uh, auto refill our stuff? It sure did. That's good design. I like that. Very good. Always do a party refill after a major battle. Excellent. Good stuffs. All right. Yeah, we're out of here.
good morning. Wait a minute. Uh, what was it? What, was it evening? Were we fighting in a realm without the concept of time, perhaps? Yeah, exactly. Carl, Carl knows what's up. He's like, wait a minute. Motherfucker, hold up. I guess the dawn. Wait, what? Since we're warriors of the solstice or solstice warriors or whatever, we control time? Or the sunrise? Oh, okay. And then what? Something inside of you knows already. Okay, yeah, I'm guessing that's that thing over there. Yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But is, is, is this really right, though? Like, we're fucking with the time stream a bit? Or bringing out the sun or the moon just at random intervals? And we could really, uh... Oh, we can rewind time as well. What if we go back to the previous day? Let's do that. Hey, there we go. <laughs> yeah, that's one way to bring it about, right? Find mechanism that seals powered by magical runes that react to the time of day. Okay, okay, all right. And the place where solstice warriors came before us and we can steal artifacts, blah, 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 blah. Let us steal away evils that were too powerful to confront. Let her not to look for these artifacts and challenges are entirely up to you. Okay, so side quests. Little side bits. That's cool. We're going to do as many of those as we can. Now we can officially do a thing. We can go out on an adventure. <laughs> but, uh, uh, <laughs> use our powers. Me on the other side, in this parallel gift, I share with you what I could read in the mist of time. Charge a smaller rune on the ground above to see what happens. Oh, I see. Okay. I see. All right. Oh, that's cool. So it's not just, uh,. It's not just straight up night and day, it's like a varied amount of varied time. I like that. That's cool. Extremely good. Man, whoever's like awake during this day is like, what the fuck? What's going on with the sun and the moon? Why are they doing weird shit? It's like, ah, oh, don't worry about it, it's just the solstice warriors doing their thing. Cool. Cool, cool. I like that mechanic. That's neat. That's neat and good. Ready to be sent out into the world? No, not yet. Um, well, I mean, I guess we are. Like, where else are we gonna go? Yeah, alright, we're ready. Is this thing gonna just huck us through the sky? Is this secret of mana cannon, tra cannon travel, but with a fist? Prophecies. Okay. First need to stare at the night inside of you. Hmm. That's a little ominous. <laughs> it's like, uh, wait a minute. Create paths on water. Oh shit, she's gonna walk on water. That's cool. And what about, yeah, Garl gets one too? Hell yeah. It's like, yeah, boy. Mindful of your limitations during this journey. What the hell? What kind of vague ass fortune cookie ass bullshit is that? Come on. That's, ah, he's like, yeah, I got it. <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Uh, soothe a long tormented soul. There we go. That's the fortune we were looking for, right? Or fate. Or whatever. Prophecy. There we go. Sleeper Island. Fated to meet a crew bound for adventure. Are we gonna join a pirate ship? That seems likely. Maybe, maybe, oh, okay. Maybe they won't call themselves pirates. Maybe they'll be privateers some other correct term, right? 
Give it the name Extol to be sent to Sleeper Island. Okay. Turn here, simply go to Extol and speak this one's name, which is... <laughs> Carl, please. Ah, well, see ya! <laughs> okay, I was right. We just get fucking hucked into the sky. Alright. Well, see ya, Elder Mist. <laughs> Boy, that landing's gonna be rough, though. That landing will not be pleasant. Alright, so that was that was one of the stories from the Archivist, right? We were sent off, we got their warrior cook, yep. And we soon see two powerful wizards. Spoilers, man, come on. One by anger and the other by life bereft. Okay, so a lich and an angry wizard. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Or a necromancer? Maybe a necromancer. A rage mage and a necromancer. That's what I'm going to go with. Oh, okay. Well, jeez. Wow. Nice. One-handed. Good grab. Oh. They, they're, they're fine. <laughs> wow. The hell of a throw by good old Lextol there. Alright, here we are. Area two. Did we get a map? Do we have a map? Like an overworld map? Eh, maybe not. Try all buttons again. Nope, okay. Well, that's fine. Only go to a few different spots anyway. Yeah, look at that. Oh, hidden ass cave. Oh. Yoinkaruski. Solstice Mage Ring. Okay. Uh, Mage. I mean, they're both magic users, right? So, uh, Valer, why don't you get that? However, one MP when they time a block. Oh, sick. Nice. Alright, I'm into it. Hmm, although... You know what, maybe I'm gonna give that to, uh, Zale instead. <clears throat> Cause, um... He does the big boy damage with the fireball. And I like that. 90 gold. Nice. Okay. I think this would have been the main path if we had chosen it, right? Okay. Oh, some wheat. Presuming that's wheat. Grains, alright. Grains is fine too, I guess. Alright, let's kind of see if we can time this such that we're going to be like, Hey, fucko. Yeah, get you some. Hey, you did three that time. Nice. Okay. Well, alright, Zale. Guess what you're going to do? <laughs> Actually, how much do they have? 39? Oh, that's going to be fun. Alright. Hell yeah. 30, oh, 38 only. That's okay. Um, get this fucker out of here. Nice. Alright. Ah, I can't believe he's got one fucking... One fucking HP. Alright, Garl. No kill like overkill. Yeah, get you some. Good stuff. Tightrope walking, that's that's wild. I could not uh, I couldn't do that. I would lose my balance like a big old fool. Oh hey, look at that. Rainbow conch. Oh, what's that? Is 
that an equipable? No. Is that a saleable? No. Is that a... No? Oh, it's a key item. Okay. Might interest a collector. Well, looks cool. Why don't I... Well, what if I want to keep it? What if I am a collector that I am interested in keeping it? Okay, and there's the bit out of here. Alright. Potatoes. Oh, didn't even see that person up there. Sick. Oh, oh they got portals. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I want the portal. Can I have the portals? Maybe I get portals later. That would be cool. Ah! Save point. Okay. Oh, and also new sets of enemies. Oh, okay. It was a bird. Oh, yeah, hey, look at you. Yeah, what'd you see? Nothing! <laughs> uh, 32, huh? Now nah, we're just gonna do it. Oh, resisted, huh? I think Garl does smashy smash, right? Okay. Uh, how much does he have left? 14? I don't know if even a powered up attack is a 14. Now, well, if I double tapped it properly, like a smartman. Oh, that's a weird timing. Okay. There we go. That's better. Alright, Garl, why don't you just finish this fucker off, huh? There you go. Defensive boys. That's right. 108 XP though. Hell yeah. Tell we're in a new area. Oh, look at this. Probably a break if we jump from high enough under a suspiciously placed platform. Very good. Feels like just randomly jumping down onto an unstable bit of rock seems like a bad idea though. Just saying. Oh, look at you. Oh, yeah. What do you what do you see, huh? Oh! Whoop! <laughs> oh hey! Ah! <laughs> Damn it! Oh! What do you got there? 52, huh? Well, I don't like that. How about. See how much our sunball does to you. 34 is not bad. Nice. Good block. And we got the extra MP back from that, right? Alright, well, unlikely we're gonna dunk that guy in one, so. Well, wanted to dunk him in one, but. Fucked up the, the defense yet again. Alright, we should be able to dunk this guy in too. Especially when we do that. Yeah. There we go. 26 from Zale. Alright. That's pretty good. That's pretty good stuff, huh? Oh, look at this. Time has made the runes indecipherable. Really? I see a a little cross dagger thing and a little, another little dagger thing. Seems pretty decipherable to me. Hmm. Yeah, 
imagine we'll make our way across back to the original area soon enough. Yeah, what'd you see? Nothing! <laughs> oh, we got all of them now. Uh-oh. Oh, I really could have used a fireball here. Well, let's try a moonerang instead. Or not a moonerang. Uh, crescent arc? Yeah, get them all. Oh, I guess I kind of panic tapped that. That's fine. Nice. Okay. Um, alright, Garl. I'm gonna need your nourishment here. And Zale, do you have enough for your sunball? Nah, you're missing one. Oh well. Uh, can we get him in one? Maybe. Ah, five, boo. Oh, that one's... Okay. It's like click, 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 right? There we go. Yep. Got it, got it, got it. Beautiful. Alright, Garl, can you pound this motherfucker for 25? Counting on you, buddy. Ah, 21. Damn. Well, you tried your best. Cool. Zale's taking a bit of a beating. It's alright. It's okay. Um, yeah, get you a healing light here on yourself. Okay, it's like right at the peak of that one. And the lair, and I need you to... Oh, you're gonna just pound the shit out of that guy anyways, probably. There you go. The jorb. Oh, wait. Oh, he didn't... Oh, I thought that was gonna be enough to... to murder him all. That's right. Uh, not, not quite. That's right. Zale, take care of it. Some eggs. crystal. Oh, we don't have a thing to offer to it that'll get it out of our way yet. Okay, that's fine. Get him. Ah, oh, what? That was such a... Damn it. <laughs> um, Zeal, does your... No, it does only sunny stuff, huh? Okay, I need to... Get the kick out of that dude. Out of the Roshiv. There you go. Okay. Nice. Okay. What do we got for you? 52, 40? Alright. You know what? At least get. 22 is pretty good. Okay. Team will have to do. Um, actually, wait. What do we got? Uh, okay. Power up, and then crescent arc on this. I need to learn the timing on this one, anyways, right? <laughs> I don't. As uh, the panic taps, I don't think that worked. Uh, sixteen, fifteen, huh? Uh, let's get rid of this guy. Nice. Oh. Alright, Garl. Can you do 16 on this guy? I'm sure you can. Nice. Just barely. Good job, Garl. Okay. Good stuff. Um, you know what, Zale? I need you to... Oh, that's not a party heal. Do we have a party heal? We do, but we need two combo bits. Damn. I don't think we'll probably get two combo bits. Well, we might get two combo bits before end of thing here. We'll see. There, there's two combo bits. Ending light and focus on Garl, I suppose. There we go. Wow, 65s across the board. 
job, crew. Alright, there we go. Let's use the old noodle. Oh, well, looks like there's another jump on this to proceed type thing. Kind of curious if we were going to get back to that original one. Alright, I gotta be like, hey, no. Whoop. Get him. Yeah! <laughs> oh, where'd these two fuckers come from? Come on. Okay, um. 52 a pop, huh? Okay. Okay, Garl, you should be able to eliminate that other fucker now. Right? 16? I think we got this. Nice! Yeah! Okay. And then, uh... 14? Seems not bad. Oops. Eh. Ah, nuts. Um, Garl, are you gonna be able to do that dude in for eight without a power magic without using magic? Ah, too shy. That's right. Okay. Uh, well, Valer, I'm gonna need you to do something about that. Let's just do this. Kind of an awkward angle to see that thing coming in, yep. Whoopsie doopsie. That's good enough. Nice! Level up! Do we get a, a party heal for leveling up too, I wonder? Fucking love that they used the messenger's best song on the OST for the fucking level up tune. It's the greatest. Okay, what did we do before? We did physical attack and physical defense, right? I wouldn't mind a little bit more hip. A little bit more hip all the way around, huh? Ah, oh, we don't got hip for sale here. All right. Um. Okay, maybe some more magic attack then. And then Garl, since you ain't got magic, well, he's got magic. He's got the magic of cooking. Um, let's give you some hip. Excellent. Did that heal everybody? Ah, oh, it didn't. Boo! But also understandable. What we got here? Tomatoes? Lettuce? Where's the bacon plant? Really complete the meal. <laughs> Okay, are we getting around to the place I need to get around to here? Or are we gonna have to go back? I think we're gonna have to go back. I don't want to do what is very clearly the way to progress here. I don't want to do that. Can I just jump down? Okay, thank you. I just want to jump down there and go back. It's one. I want to get up. here. Here. Okay, I can go up there. And then I want to go back to the left and jump down through that rocky hole thing first. I didn't see a way to get up there. Though. Power belt? Hell yeah. Um, Here, Garl. Plus four to attack. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Got our warrior cook a, a bit more potent. Alright. Find out where to, we're supposed to go to. Oh, probably just here. Duh. Uh, well, maybe, actually. Maybe not. It's a bit further back. Oh, I see. Let's climb up here. That's what I missed earlier. But 
also this. Whatever this happens to be. Oh, more tomatoes. See what we got. Bonk. Fancy. Mushrooms. Okay. Just a few more craftable bits there. Both could take a real quick save here. Huh? Just in case the dangerous stuff might be approaching. Although I guess that's not true. If something were truly dangerous, they would probably offer me a campsite, and then I'd be like, yes, please, rest, free heal, etc. The worst we'll have to face here some normal, basic idiots, right? And then this thing, of course, which we don't have enough. Offerable for that. That's right. We'll get it later. Down on this second cracked rock, Dillabop here. Zerbonk. Surely not ominous at all. A dilapidated burlap sack with a skull next to it. Sure, we're fine. Uh, okay, this feels like uh, progression over this side. I figured it was going to be a hidden bit, so it's not exactly clear that's an entrance, but maybe this probably just takes us back up and out. Yeah, okay, never mind. We're fine. out for secrety secrets they haven't seemed to be too obscure just yet which is fine I can deal with uh... all right bonk <laughs> Idiot. oh lots of slashy bits here um Zale do you have a thing that does group slashies no unfortunate okay well Get one of them out of here. Oh, Carl, come on. Um, okay, well, either way, I don't think we're. Well, unless. You know what? Fuck it. Use the. Oh, I don't have enough points! How many points do I need for the thing? Seven. I don't have seven points. All right, fine, whatever. Let's just uh, get this guy out of here then. Oh, no, he's not dead yet. Boo. Uh-oh. Carl might be taking a nap. Oh, no. Oh, well, we're fine. Okay. All right, get this guy out of here then. Okay, and then that guy's gonna attack. Um, our heal combo is two combo bits, right? So we can't do that. So let's get this guy out of the turn order there. And then this guy, who depends on who he attacks. Oh, Garl, sorry. Why don't you have a, <clears throat> have a little tiny nap there, buddy? You'll be fine. This 30 is pretty solid. How much we got left there? 22. Probably make that work. Yeah. Oh, come on, one short again? Boo!
Okay, now let's see what we do here. Okay, we got two combo bits. Garl's back. Um, may as well do a boosted fucking Healy bits, right? 76? Damn, that's fucking strong. Nice. Okay. Uh, can we do 13 with a non boosted normal attack? No, fives. Boop. Okay, that's fine. Well, we'll be pretty much net positive with health here. It's fine. Okay, good stuff. Oh, I see. Alright, so there's a conch shell looking lock up there. There's a fire over there. Can we, uh, push this thing? No. Well, we might have to, actually, from the from below. So that seems like a thing that would go on this thing over here, and then we can get up there and open the chest. Yeah, okay, okay. Whee! Yeah, there. Teal Amber Ore. That's a saleable, isn't it? Hell yeah. Worth some money. Eh? 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 Oh, come on. Figured that would have been a, a push thing there. Alright, well, maybe not yet. Okay. Good spot to have a little rest. I guess it would behoove us to to make some food and stuff too, huh? We got so many things with which to cook. Roast sandwich. Sounds pretty good. 60 hip. 50 hip. 8 mip. 35 hip, 5 mip, 35 hip. Okay, well, how many? We got lots of, uh... Oh, you need five berries for that? I mean, that's the only thing that uses berries so far, so, yeah, give me, give me that. Good to have a, a little mip booster there, and then... Yeah, I wouldn't mind a couple larger helibips here. Cool, it shows you the, the steps for it on the right. I like that. Oh, we can only carry so many food bits. Oh. R really? Oh. Okay, well, that seems unfortunate. Can we just use one of them? Okay, let's just use one of the, the low-tier ones, and then we'll... Well, let's use two of the low-tier ones. We'll leave one spot open, and then we'll uh, make a higher bit. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> Maybe this weekend I'll have enough time to actually fix that. Uh, alright, so I was gonna make the herb to fill it. <laughs> okay. All cooked, all healed. And away we go. Is gonna be like, rah, rah, rah. oh, that was definitely a back attack, motherfucker. Okay, what do we got? 52, 35, so we got three turns. Two turns on that guy. There we go, that's better. Garl, you can finish the job on that idiot.
right? You can hit for 10. There you go, good boy. Oh. Uh, what do we got? Oh, it's just a... Oh wait, uh, this one, right? There we go, nice. And Zael, you got no extra power bits for you, sorry. Ah, uh, and then we duffed up the combo. Good job. Crap. Ah, uh, no, it calls for help! I hate it. Okay. Uh, that's no good. Okay, all three we can definitely dispose of. Even if we fuck up. It's kind of pathetic, but what are you going to do? Good block. Okay, I have two skill bits again. Um, we might be best off doing a group heal. He's going to get an attack regardless of what we do, pretty much. So, um, bup, 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 bup. Triple knights. Ah. Eh, whatever. Oh, he gets to attack again? Excuse me, sir. Fast little shithead. I guess either way our group heal was probably wasn't the uh, save us no matter what. Alright. Whatever. Good enough. 44 XP, a little bit of stuff there, some meats. Kind of take something around there. Oh, oh, look out for you. Oh, look out. What do we got here? Uh, that's the thing that we don't have the thing for. Aha! <laughs> ah, it's three of them. Okay. Moon bits and fireball, huh? Well, guess what? I think fireball is gonna go first. And we'll use the super fireball on uh, center boy there. Nice. Okay, 45 is pretty good. And then we'll do moonerang. You, and hopefully we get enough bounces that it goes the fuck away. Okay, that's exactly what we wanted at least. I would have preferred a few more, but that's fine. Okay, good, uh, good triple block. Yeah, not bad. Mm. Oh, okay. Let's see, this feels like uh, progress over here, but hey, all right, a better weapon for Garl. Simply plus four, plus two, hell yeah. that just yet. Um, no, there's another fall through bit. Yeah, there. Okay. I'll just do those as soon as I see them so I don't have to double back all the time. Oh! Except this is a Rock bit, then a rock bit here. 
Okay, I'm gonna zoom it out. Ooh. Let's see. Whoop. Oh, look out. Oh, excuse me. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah, would you? Oh, come on. Ah! <laughs> all right, what do we got? Oh, crack them all, huh? Uh, shh. Shoots. Okay, that causes thingabips there, but not a double thingabip unless I time it right, yeah? And I can't hit more than one anyway. Well, I think we're kind of boned on this regardless, so we can at least get two of them out of the running. And that one. He's gonna call for help, isn't he? Damn it. <laughs> oh, he called two of them! Oh shit! Dude! Oh no. Okay, that could be a problem if they do that more than once. Ah. Even more of a problem if I keep duffing up the shit here. Okay, well, no, this is this is alright. We can do this. Ah. Okay. Mm. Oh, they are targeting the correct people here. I don't like it. Okay, good. Carl, get out of the way. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, this could be a a small issue here, huh? Can I? Look at. Hmm. I wanted to look at stats to see who had better attack to dunk this dude in one, but. I think Garl probably can. For seven? He can handle seven, right? Yeah, there you go. You just got your new pot lid. You better be able to do fucking seven. Okay, lucky choice on that. Um, I don't have two combo bits yet. Uh, Zale, do you have enough for your sunball? You don't. That's okay. We're gonna try to hold out for the combo heal. Can you do ten? You can do ten with a charge, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's good. That's good shit. Okay, now we got two combo bits. That's good, too. Um, so let's do... All right, Garl, I'm gonna need you to knock the shit out of this one up here. I guess either way, this guy down here is gonna get an attack. Let's use you to get some magic bits, right? And then we can go plop and combo heal. Seventy-six seems good. Party is saved. Excellent. This is fine now. All right, eight. Zale, can you do eight? Did Garl do eight? Garl did eight, right? Oh, he's not gonna be able to go. All right. Um. Ah, probably could have done eight if I hadn't flubbed the combo. Oh well. I know you can definitely do four without a charge, right? Oh, Garl, why don't you clean up your mess over there? There you go. Yeah, you could have done eight if I hadn't up. <laughs> ah, well. That's how it goes. Hmm, although maybe I should have focused uh, one of these guys down. Maybe we can still hit 16 with this. Ah, one short. Ah, well, okay. Well, we'll weather two more attacks. It's fine. Hopefully you don't target Garl again. Hey, all right. Good. In fact, that'll give us a... chance to nourish Garl, I guess. I think I'd do it right before you chomp down on the thing. 
Okay, and then you... Okay, you only gotta do one. I'm sure you'll be fine. Do one. There. And we'll see if we can do a power attack that's enough for, what, 19? Uh, 19 might be a bit troublesome. Ah, nuts. Okay. Well, uh, it works. That works pretty well. Like, nobody died. We got 144 XP. Some eggs, some mushrooms. That's fine. For our trouble. Silver S word. All right. Oh, that's for Zale. He does S words. Plus four plus two. Excellent. Okay, yep, that was that bit that we wanted to come back for. Uh, yeah, let's put it over here. Oh, hey, look at you. You gonna see me? There you are. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. <laughs> oh, what do we got here? Oh boy, bunches of stuff. Um, okay, Zale. You can get your your fun ball in there. Is that gonna be? Does that do two sun bits or just the one? I wonder. I guess we'll see. Damn, just the one. Okay. Um, how much does twenty nine? Ugh, gross. All right. That's a small issue, because they're all going to get to go. So maybe we focus down one of them and just eat the other two. I think you can do ten, right, Garl? Okay, that, that'll have to be fine. Alright, we can eat ten damage each, that's fine. Okay, we don't have two combo bits yet, so maybe we can pull a party heal before uh, the battle is done, right? Or maybe not, because this guy's probably going to be fucking toast regardless. Yep. Alright, well, mm, unideal. Okay, there's probably a bit from the top that we can grab. Pay attention to that. Like, hey, maybe this right here. <laughs> okay, another recipe. And yes, that's fine. Oh, someone's over there. Is it the weird uh, portal ninja thing? Oh, no. oh, oh, it's the fancy cutscene again. Don't mind us. We'll just watch you creepily from from afar here. Ask for directions. Yeah, we should definitely go interrupt a random stranger as they're doing their thing. Carl, <laughs> definitely don't run up suddenly. It's a rock. Ah, come on, come on, Carl. Oh, he, no, he's holding out. 
<laughs> Shitter. Okay, yeah. Oldest form of writing. Okay. Traveling historians. Oh yeah, we know about those. Or we were told about those, right? Teeks, huh? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so caution was not the better part of Valor this time, huh? Alright, well, hello. Oh, Garl. Very smooth. They're fun. They've just been sealed away in the study in the sky for too many years. Yeah, ten years is too many years, honestly. Oh, yeah, don't worry about it. What? Magic hair. Enchanted cloth. Yes, we are... Whoa, Teeks, okay. Whoa, chill. Yes, we're Solstice Warriors. Right? Yeah, there you go, Teeks. He got there eventually. <laughs> okay, she's an energetic one. Very good. <laughs> I'm with you, Blair. Very excited. Very excited. It's about your book. You want to travel with us, Teeks? Are you going to be fourth party member? That'd be pretty cool. Last of the traveling historians, huh? Hmm. Lore grimoires. That sounds pretty rad. Chanted books that write themselves by touching artifacts with stories to tell, huh? Hmm. Make their lore grimoire as full as possible before passing it on. Used to be a guild and a whole bunch of them, but now just teeks. Just teeks. Hell yeah! Oh yeah, fourth party member. Oh. Yeah, they're always traveling, huh? Drop out your campfire whenever you're out in the open. How are you gonna do that? Do you have portals too? Okay. I mean, we've got the rainbow conch. Does that count? Is that important enough? Stumbled upon a very old pirate earring. Okay. Ghost pirate ship called the Vespertine. Oh. Dollars to donuts, we're gonna be on the Vespertine. Seems like a key word there. Eh, well, if we ask, okay, yeah, we might read that later. Yeah, let's hear a story about the Vespertine. What 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 happened? Surely something good happened to a ghost pirate ship called the Vespertine. Oh, but it has a curse named after it, so maybe not so good. Centuries, the time when a certain band of pirates ruled the sea. Stormcaller. Most powerful wind mage the world had ever known. Hortense. Shrewdest mariner on record. Blah, 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 blah. Ship was faster than light itself. That seems not true, but okay. We'll, we'll read the story. Many adventures in the... So rich. And then... You wanted to quit the pirate life. Okay. I mean, hey, you make enough money, you may as well fuck off, right? <laughs> Stormcaller didn't, uh, didn't like that. Stop conjuring wind for the sails and put them right in the middle of the ocean. And we'll remain here until Hortense decides to not quit. Well, I mean, okay, is this going to be a battle of who's more stubborn than who? Yeah, 
Yeah, exactly. And everybody else fucking suffers for it. Go figure. First they ran out of patience, and then food, and then water. <laughs> then one day, they made, uh, what's his nuts? Stormcaller walk the plank. Honk. Sea of Nightmare. You know, deadly storm for them to endure forevermore. <clears throat> well. Okay. That seems like that could have been resolved by just, you know, talking it out, but... You know, who am I to turn down a, a good motivating story, I guess. One day sink the ship, others believe eventually bound to the indomitable Hortons. Uh, gets a short break once a day, but for a few seconds, the precise time, the first is first conjured. She reported sightings of a legendary ghost pirate ship that appears dust and called Vesper Team. Climb aboard in search of treasure. Yeah, that seems ill-advised. Don't do that. You don't want... Oh, the, the end. Okay. Wow. All right. Down or ending. Okay, and Garo's just like, yeah, tell it again. I'm like, no. Hang on, where it needs to be. Okay. Can we just kind of walk off? And they'll be like, no, Valeria, where are you going? Oh, they don't let you. Boo. Okay. I guess we rest. Or cook. No, we just cook. I guess we rest. I do like the shadows there, though. That was very good. Very well done. Boat ride to Wraith Island. Hell yeah. You know, I think I know of a boat. It's called the Vespertine. <laughs> uh, the lift, huh? Yeah, I'm sure that's a puzzly puzzle we solve, and then the lift works, and then we're fine. Okay, go east. Got it. Hell yeah, so is she part of the party? Yeah, oh, joins the cargo. <laughs> Wait a minute. No. Can I, uh... Oh, we can't, like, bring her into the party proper, huh? So she's just cargo. <laughs> Great. Awesome. Okay. Off we go. Hmm, okay. Yeah, I see. Do the whole day time shifting thing here. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Whoa! Hey, look out. Alright, turn around. Oh, yeah, there we go. I counted. Excellent. Alright, um... Okay, Zale, you're up. Superpower fireball. Probably not gonna murder anybody, but hey, it'll do a Damn good job of softening them up. There we go. 58. Nice. Oh, it did murder one. Nice. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, and only seven left on that one. Alright, Carl, you go for it. Nice. Alright. Ah, probably could have gotten it in one there. That's fine. He's dead. Fucking toast. 28 XP. Good stuff. And yeah, light puzzle. Oh, the music changes by time of day, too. That's neat. I like that. Oh, I see. That's interesting. We get all three and it's good? Yeah, all right. I see what's going on there. Can we get a map? Or a combo skill. Solar rain, that sounds awesome. Um, where do I look at my combos? There we go. Or not, do I have to use the item? Is it a Zale? Okay, it's a Zale. It's a Zale Garl skill. That's neat. 
Hits all enemies. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Double combo bits. Does sun. Okay. Cool. Cool. I'm into it. I should remember there was that um, glowy crystal bit in the early bit of this area, too, that we cannot do nothing about just yet. Sneak up on this idiot. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Good, good Chrono Trigger reference. That's good shit. We're gonna bother the fuck out of this guy until he gives us a magic tab. Yeah, oh, I mean, okay. <laughs> uh, very good. Very good. Okay, extremely good. Reference the classics, right? Oh, there's another exit to this thing, too, to the fishing bit. Uh, maybe we come back for that at some point. Not now. Oh, hey, look, it's the... the snake bit that uh, Garl was talking about, wrapped around the mountain or whatever. Forget what it was called when he was talking about it. Whoa, jeez, stonemasons, huh? Oh, shit, something's going down. They're all, uh... They're all, uh, uh, jumping about something. The Elder hasn't returned. That doesn't sound good. Malcomood. Uh-oh. Run. Yeah. Panic. That'll help. But wait, wait. Who are you? Have you come to save us? You sh y y yes No, but yes. <clears throat> Carl. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, uh, Garl. Heart's in the right place, buddy. But yeah, okay, let's see. What what, what can we do? Earth Elemental Wizard, Malcomoon. Peace of the law, plus taking care of the mines. Wind tunnels. Oh, yeah, yeah. Our job to keep them unobstructed so the sleeper can blah, 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 can sleep. Yep, yep. Now I'm going to take over the mines so we can't go in anymore. If the sleeper wakes, it'll be the end of the world! I Well, I don't think it'll be that severe, but yeah, it sounds bad, though. Log the tunnel powering the great elevator's windmill, so we can't even go to Brisk to ask for help. We need to start pouring out of the mines and 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 oh! All right, we'll help. I guess. I'm gonna try to stop him, but it's been so long. Oh, he's probably dead. Uh, where's the entrance? It's up there. Okay, to the north. Got it. Got it. Do you have a a shop and or a blacksmith or weapons or armor or whatever? Cause we got some money. Oh, I guess they're molds. Okay. That tracks. I was getting a definite Moleville vibe out of this. All right, and then I guess we uh, cargo teaks over here. So. Hooray. Does it work? It does not work. Alright, that looks like a shop, and or an elder's house, and or a shop. Oh, it's an inn. Uh, rest in your geothermal room. Sure. Is it free? It's free. Cool. I'm good with that. Oh, this is cool. Evil wizard. Well, who knows? Like, maybe Malcomood isn't evil. Maybe he's just misunderstood, or maybe he's got good intentions, and maybe, like, there's so many things that could be going on with Malcomood here. Just assuming it's evil is kind of not the best assumption to make. Okay, so free heals. That's good. Open for a, a weapon and or armor shop, too. Maybe this one? Hey, what you got? 
There it is. Need my tools to fix the busted door, but they're in the back room and I can't get through. Lever on the other side seems to work. If only there was another way to enter. Yeah, if only there was these not extremely obvious ledges to climb up and drop down behind, right? Oh, we can't do that. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, I see what they're doing. So it's up higher. Got it. Holy fine. Oh, did we talk to this one? Wait, 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 sorry. The other one in, the elevator hasn't returned. I suppose one would just have to jump in. That's a one-way trip. Ill-advised one-way trip. Oh yeah, hey, look at that. That's probably the entrance to the thing I'm about. Let's do that while we're thinking of it. Also, I broke your ceiling. Don't worry about it, buddy. Forgot about the shimmy animation, it's great. Okay, saleable. Saleable. There you go. Open the door. Oh, I see. It's a it's a back room. It's not a ledge to climb up. I didn't see that before. Alright, buddy. I did not steal your stuff, don't worry. <laughs> okay. Some good Smurf Pig reference there. I like it. <laughs> no, we kinda swiped your shit. Oh, okay. Very good. <laughs> uh, excellent. Alright, random homestead. That's fine. Yeah, we're solstice warriors. We're awesome. Can't go out. It's boring in here. There's, why can't you go out? There's nothing bad happening out there. My kids go outside with everything going on. It's too What do you mean everything going on? There's nothing going on out there. Malcomood is off in the other cave, and the rest of the village is just fine. Like, lady, come on. I went around just a moment ago. Grown-ups are weird. I hear you, kid. Grown-ups are weird. What about other kid? Work in the ground like your parents. <laughs> I'm sure you'll do fine, kid. Alright, what are, what are you? Thumbs keep getting clogged, the window will stop playing, blah blah blah, sleeper wakes up, yada yada yada, uh-huh. What you got? Okay, uh, ancient Molkin cloak. Is that considered an armor? What is that? Oh, it's, uh... Oh, I see. Okay. We, we give Teeks uh, another story that she doesn't even have to write herself because she's got a magic auto-writing book. Lucky her. All right, what's up here? Careful in the mines, monstrous salamander. Got it. All right, watch out for the monstrous salamander. We're not done here, though. One of these has to be a shop. The panic, I'd rather come on a studio. All he does is paint all day long. I mean, you know. Clearly a path over there, right? Yeah, there you are. Yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good portrait. Eight out of ten. Best work ever. Oh, I see. So here's like the, the Chrono Trigger glowy door bits, right? This will probably move at some point, and then I think we got the conch shell, which unlocked that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sensing a trend here. We don't have the power of wind to turn this very obvious wind turbine looking thing to unlock the whatevers, right? Yeah, okay. Very good. Come back to that later. Yeah, see? This kid's got the right idea. Why is everybody mad at Malcomood? One, he's got a pretty silly name. Like, Probably not great for him growing up, but... Two, we don't know anything about him. Maybe he's probably not evil. Probably not evil. Water mill stopped functioning after a million clogged wind tunnels. No more water in the well. I don't want to take a to help. I mean, yeah, sure. It's 
That's where we're headed eventually, right? Oh, hey, Teeks. You wanna... Yeah, you wanna get a story from this old bit of cloth we found? There you go. And we got that. That was the artist studio thing. Did we go in here? This is the home, right? Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no, we stole his shit. Did that. That was the back of that. Not much else to it except to go in the mines and go see what the hell Milk Mood's all about here. Guess there's another thing down here. Can we really just kind of jump down? Oh, that would have been funny. No, they're like, no, that's too high. Don't, don't do that. All right, into the mines we go then. Kind of bummed there wasn't a shop though. Maybe not in this, uh, this town here, but maybe the next one. No jumping down! We're not gonna put up, like, a guardrail or anything. Just, here's the sign telling you not to jump down. Oops, I jumped down. Also, whoa, jeez. Uh, that would have shattered some ankles. You the Elder? I, uh, yeah. Who, who are you? Closest warriors. We're gonna go talk to Malkaboot. Don't worry about us. Yeah, what the fuck's happening here, buddy? Not much. Trying to get away from the noise, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> they all assumed he was going to go fix it. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, great. So now he's stuck. All right, well, I guess we're here now. I guess we're here now. Very good. Okay, good. There's a save point here, too. Clearly, we're going to have to push that at some point, but we lack the power to do so. Perhaps a glove or a bracelet or a gauntlet or something that we need to do that stuff. What's this? The break room? That sounds fun. Oh, hey, there's another dude down here. There! There's the merchant! Okay. Okay, well, we've got a silver S word already. Could use a miner's smock, yes. Equip the Garl and sell the adventurer's vest, get the new staff for, or the new S staff for uh, uh, Valair there. We're tapped up on everything else, that's good. Oh, we can sell our saleables. Excellent. And our other things that we're never gonna equip again. I can even sell food. Okay. I mean, I can see that. Alright, you know what? Let's sell one of the tiny ones. Made out with uh, more money than we walked in with. That's, feeling, that's pretty good. Okay. And then we're in the first actual dungeon dungeon thing. Seems good. I imagine we'll get the ability to move those things very shortly here. Oh, look out for that one. Oh, look out for that one. Oh, they're gonna try. Ah, I just couldn't quite climb away. Oh, what the hell even are those? Those are fucking nightmare fuel. Drill bats? I'm gonna say no, I don't want that. 24 is pretty solid. Vulnerable to slash. Or to getting the shit beat out of them, I guess, too. That works. Uh, 35. Okay. 
Okay. And the, another three tap there. I wonder if that's considered just one block or three. Kind of cool if it was three blocks. Oh, that's nice. nice. Alright. Beautiful. Lots of XP for very little risk. Oh, got some bones. Oh, and a... Oh, okay, I see. Looked like it was going down vertically and not just moving horizontally there. Three eggs. Probably don't trust random eggs you find in a deep mine cave thing. Seems ill-advised. Not exactly what one should probably be doing. Okay. First windmill is reactivated. Oh, okay. Well, all right. We'll have to uh, work out how to do that. Oh, and we can just use his skill on the fucking windmill too. That's cool. That makes sense. clack on this thing, so who knows what that was about. Oh! Oh, there's another little shimmy sham over here, okay. Oh, that's cool. Good visual effect there, a little distortion to see, see through the crystal. Very good. The little details. Very excellent. What is that? Oh, max hip up. Uh, since you couldn't get the hip upgrade, right? Here, you take it, Zale. See, Valer's the only, like, super courageous one and does back to the wall. Although I wonder which would be better for shimming along a ledge like this. Would it be better to face inward or outward? Oh, okay, easy. Now that we'll be able to... sneak up on this group in here. Yeah! On. I really like the the first strike things. Yeah, there you go. Get him! Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, look at that fucker. That guy's got all three. We're not going to be able to do that, but we should be able to murder him in two at least, right? Only two. Hmm, that might be questionable actually now. Twenty-two. Wow, mm, 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 mm. oh. Valeria tried. Good, good try. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Oh, that's not so bad. Okay. Well, let's get at least one of them out of here. Probably be able to power attack this fucker too, so eh. 
Yeah, nice. Good job, Zale. Okay, chest up there, and a big long path. Up here. And something that we don't have key item for. Very good. More saleable. Oh, this is just the other side to go up. We could go up and around and be big dumb cowards, but we already did the fight. It doesn't matter. Unassailable right now. I imagine. Oh god, that's so cool. Very good effect. Um, I imagine we'll need to get in there, and knock something down, and push it around, and do whatever. But Let's certainly get that ability here-ish. Come on! Ah, there's got to be a way to do that. Whoa! Lots of moons. And some fire. Oh, there's a thing back there. What is that thing? Bush true. Bush true? Bush true. I don't like that. That makes me a little worried. So, uh, moonerang the shit out of that. Serviceable enough. How much health does it get? 76! Okay, well, guess what? Um, Zale, are you ready? Yeah, you're ready to go. What does that other middle one have? 33? Can his fireball, unpowered fireball, do that, maybe? Guess we'll find out. Twenty. Not enough. That's right. Well, at least the uh, Broke big boy out of the turn order there. Seventeen. All right, Garl, can you uh, do seventeen on that idiot? Yeah, you can. Twenty-eight, even. Nice. Good job. Ooh. Uh. Hmm. Ooh, I don't think we're getting fifty-one out of that. Uh, we need two, two bits for solar rain, huh? That's not happening. Crap. Alright, what's this thing gonna be? Something. Okay, good, good read. Wasn't terrible. Okay, we got two combo bits now. That'll be good for a party heal. Super party heal. Seventy-nine. Damn, fucking strong. And then we can probably double tap the fuck out of this idiot now. 20, and then what? How much you gotta do, Garl? Four? I think you got this. Yeah, no problem. Oh, and that unblocked the winds. So we got the winds. We shall follow the winds. Whoa, hey, oh. <laughs> A partial Chrono Trigger reference there, too. We did it! The elevator is active, you can get the fuck out of here now, Elder. Yeah, see, see ya. I see ya, I guess. Suppose we jump down and then keep going. Alternatively, I want to see if this did anything. Activate that. I 
anything else that it did activate whilst we're up here? This would have been a path all the way around. Yeah, okay. No, oh, that's fine. I think the break room is just the merchant, right? Yeah, oh, I guess we could go for a, a refill, even though we didn't have much to refill, because we did pretty good at that battle. But, you know, may as well top off. Top off and save as one does in an adventure. Okay, and then we can proceed. A lot of, like, block pushy bits. Imagine we'll be able to do that soon. Nope, oh, whoa, hey buddy. Whoa, ow! <laughs> oh, gross. Okay, um, well, I definitely do not want this guy to fucking summon allies. So, eat shit. I bet that's a three tap. It's like a three tap block thing. It'll do way less than 19. Um, okay, now that unfortunately is going to be troublesome. Do, I guess I do have fire. Focus this guy. Just don't have like a multi-hit fire. That's kind of the big problem. Twenty-seven. Damn. All right. Uh, are we gonna be able to do twenty-eight? Ah, too short. Damn it. Yeah, look at that. Okay, well, it only reduces it by four, but hey, it's something. Uh, you know what? No, we'll wait on that. We'll get this guy out of here. Imagine we can do a party heal here, just for Grinzies. Seventy nines across the board. Fucking great. Okay. Look at that resists physical. That's all right. Two clearly door things here. Oh, I see a chest down there. Can we can we jump? There we go. Gimme. Oh, another rainbow conch. Okay, that's not a unique key item thing, huh? Hmm. Oh no, is this the fucking collectibles all over the world type thing for this key? Oh, no. I don't like those. Unless there's a good way to track them all down, I don't really like worldwide collectible stuff. It's gonna bother me. We'll get, like, so many and it'll be like, no, you're missing a half dozen or whatever. Like, son of a... <laughs> oh, okay. I guess we're not going back that way. Until and unless we figure out how to push that thing. that each character has their own like very subtly colored aura of light around them. That's fucking sick. I like that. Valerius is blue and then Zales is orange and then Garl is just like ah, whatever. It's white. Okay. 
Gotta be getting block pushing here soon. Oh, yeah, maybe speaking of. Yeah, alright, it's a bracelet. Maybe let's just call it a power bracelet and be done with it. Oh, okay, so we're not pushing, we're using wind. <laughs> That's a little disappointing, honestly. Like, poof. <laughs> poof. Uh. But, you know, I guess it does the thing, so whatever. It's just a little... Whoa, jeez, okay, that's more... More pep to it than is uh, immediately evident. Whoa, hey, whoa, excuse me, what is this bearded lizard-looking motherfucker? Um, we're not gonna be able to... Man... That's moon and whatever? Uh, wait, 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 hold on. Oh, that does both moon and, uh, physical. Okay. Or crush or blunt or whatever. So let's start with you. Get that out the way, right? And then Valair, I'll have you do crescent arc. One of these times we'll get the timing on it. Okay, so now he's, he's not doing shit. Um, this has boss music written all over it, so big boy damage. Doing big boy damage things. 59, pretty good. Good big boy damage. Okay. Vulnerable to blunt, got it. Oh, okay. Bit of a delay. Oh, this is the salamander dude. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, want a hint on the crest dark time? No, I'll figure it out eventually. Hopefully sooner rather than later, but you never can tell sometimes. Nice, okay. Oh, I forgot that she's got the whole, like, life sap thing too. That's super good. All right, let's get this first, just in case we need a big boy fireball. Well, okay, a little bit early on that one, I think. Uh, actually, no, no. Oh, I, well, once I do the power up, I can't do it again. I can't release it. That's right. I was gonna leave it for uh, big boy damage here, but oh, what? And then he's down to one. Ah, crap. Well, I want to see what he's doing here. Oh, never mind. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Salamander. Yeah, get the hell out of here, you coward. Aw, that's nah, gonna be a refight, I'm sure. Okay, so now we've got the movie bits, right? Oh yeah, look at this. Look at this Sokoban ask a block moving puzzle. All right. Yeah, all right. We we're 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 up on this. No problem. We got this. Lock moving puzzles are not terribly difficult. <laughs> we got there a mines key. Okay, yeah, that looked like the the fancy weirdo not quite heart shaped thing. That and that was the was that the collapse thing from before? Oh no, this is a newish area. What okay, that's an ant thing over there. Okay, let's go up there. Be like, wait for him to turn around. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> okay, three is ones. Can we get to uh, probably get this fucker out of here, huh? It's like 19, 17, or 15, depending on how many blocks we hit. Alright, just to make sure we get this guy out. Oh, 18, okay. Uh, no kill like overkill. Mmm... 
crap do? Are we gonna be able to get it in two? Yeesh. Uh. Hope so. Ugh. Well, maybe, actually. Ah, nope. Should have focused on the other guy. Well, no matter, we'll have probably a party heal available to us. Hopefully a party heal <laughs> available to us. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um... Should we risk that they're not gonna hit Zale there? Should I just take... You know, I'm just gonna take the party heal. Whatever. Oh, well, duffed up the combo. Didn't matter, we're still at full. It's fine. Okay, could have waited, but oh well. All because I wanted this Teal Amber Ore. Hooray, what was that, 20 bucks? 30 bucks or something? Money either way, I guess. Worth it. Hmm. Oh. Eh? Yeah? Yeah? Aw. Ah. Ah. Rot roll. <laughs> uh. Pick and choose what we're gonna do here. Um, okay, Garl. Get you on this fucker. Right? And then we can work on the others. Okay, good. And then, um, I'm gonna ring here. Oh, that's one, two, three, four. Okay, we're gonna have to be on our mustard a bit with this. Start with you. Oh, okay, that went to an unexpected one. Uh. Ah, nice, okay, that was pretty good. Ah, nuts. Okay, good good stuff, Zale. You got it. Uh, I don't have a... Well, I can do a big boy fireball. Well, a medium boy fireball, I guess. At least get... It's down to, what, 63% or whatever? 62? Alright, good guess. And what was this thing? Right, this. Okay, yeah, no problem. Almost up to another party heal anyway. Uh, 39 only on that fucker, huh? Mm, those dudes are vulnerable to blunt, right? So yeah, this should work. 18. Nice, okay. Yes, and then... Oh, crap. That dude's gonna do whatever over there. Eh, that's probably fine. I do probably want 39. We can get that in two. Oh, maybe not, actually. Shit. <laughs> Nuts. Hmm. Garl, can you do 19? Probably not. Okay. Oh, and he can't do the party heal either. Sugar. Oh, <laughs> uh, I might have fucked that up a little bit. That's right. Uh, I can probably not do 20 damage here. We'll still have a party heal. Yeah, oh, easy peasy. There we go. Okay, and he's got one, and he's got two over there. 29? 
Scarlet can probably do 29 with the powered up thing, right? Oh, okay, pretty close. Close enough, anyways. Uh, Alright, Garl, I'm gonna need you to go... Well... No, 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 no! Ah, fuck. Oops. Well, either way, I guess. 28, not gonna do 29 there. Alright. Oh, that was Garl! Wait, what the fuck? Oh, I might have, uh... Swapped off a Zale unexpectedly, but he murdered him, so that's good. Yeah, the lock system is pretty fun. Like, that's good shit. It tells you what you can do, and then it's up to you to do it, right? Like, it's not obscure, it's not trying to pull a fucking fast one on you. It's good. Good implementation. You can tell something nasty's coming your way, like, yeah, I'm into it. There we go. Okay, see? That worked. Worked out. 264 XP, nice. And that was the thing. Um, do we want to... Ah, I guess we're going to head back that way anyways. Okay. Right, just climb up a bit. Yeah, okay. I figured that was going to do something. A little something, something there, right? And I'm sure that'll lower that thing down so we can push it around, etc. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I see what's going on here. There's another one over to the left that we gotta do. So, poof there. Yep, okay. Okay, you know what? The, the wind to move the blocks is way better than just having having the folks actually push them, because that feels like it's way faster. I don't want to sit here for fucking 10 million years waiting for them to shove a block across the screen. That's good. That's good design right there, too. Boy, how do we avoid this? Do we even want to avoid it? No, I want to fight him. Let's see if we can do a back attack thing here. Eh? Oh. <laughs> All right. Um. Okay, now this is a good spot to do this, I guess. Right? Forty-four. Actually, no. I'm gonna do first. Get some power. Get some power in there, right? And then do flip, flip. Could have done big boy fireball too, I suppose, right? But eh. Okay, yeah, fuck that up too. Oh, 28, just enough. Good job, girl. Seven, ah, one short, really? A layer. Okay, ah, uh, 32. <laughs> Alright, we'll definitely have another, another level up before the day is done here. That feels like that's our our 10th uh, food stuffs thing. Yeah, okay, so we may as well kind of cycle these out. 20, so here you go, Zale. Good time for it, honestly. Hit, hit, hit. Wish they would stop tunneling so I could at least attempt to go like a back attack thing. Oh boy. Uh, shit. It's not. Our... Yeah, we need two combo bits for the solar rain. That's. Thanks. Most of this is fire now, too. Well, shit. The only one we can really knock out is Dude Face McGee on the bottom there. We've got enough for a big boy fireball, but I would almost prefer to maybe do Garl first. You can do this fucker, right? Get those, and then big boy fireball 
on... Oh yeah, center bit right there. Perfect. Seventy-one! Oh damn, double kill! Alright, good. Good shit. Oh, whoops. Too early. Uh, uh, uh I guess we're... Uh, kind of left for... Left with this to at least reduce that to 75%, presumably. Serviceable enough. Okay, 49 there. Can we just say goodbye to this fucker in one go? Zale, are you gonna do this for us? Yes, you are. Good job, buddy. And then, uh. 49. 49 and 2, huh? I don't think that's happening. We'll try it. Definitely not happening. Let's get one more attack. It's gonna be a full power, but it's fine. Thirteens really isn't that much, anyways, and we can do a combo heal in the meal meantime here. Easy peasy, and then a level up. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> Great. Give the fucking composer a raise. Good shit, good shit. Alright, what do we got? Defense, MIPS, physical attack, magic defense. Honestly. Not bad, but physical defense is good, too. Okay, Zale, you were the one that couldn't get the hips before, so here, you take the hips this time. And then Garl. Physical defense, yeah. Okay, and there's that one, very good. What I should probably do, if it'll let us, is go back up the floor and use the weird mind key thing. And whatever that was. Which, I guess we're gonna have to go back up the floor anyways, right? Because there's no way it doesn't go deeper. Then means okay, this here. <laughs> okay, I got it. And then I imagine we'll just zoom this one over to the left, yeah? Zerp. Yeah, I think that other door was over here somewhere, wasn't it? Or was it up a floor? No, it was definitely... I think we shimmy-sham out of this room, right? Up there is 
Shimmy sham across here. Or was it on the surface? Now I don't remember. I don't remember if this weird mine key door was on the surface. Or if it was up here. Let's find out. In here, that's where we fought the group of enemies, right? Oh, no, there it is. Okay. No, we good. Is that a single use bit, or do we still have it? Single use. Alright. I forgot about that, actually. Cool, can we just jump down? Hell yeah, there we go. Now we're talking. Jump down right to it. And this better be worth it. It is a trader signet, huh? What is that? Interest to a certain merchant, huh? Okay, I mean, good to have. Better to have than to not. I suppose. That it's not going to be for the merchants in this area. <clears throat> or at least in this level, right? That would be a little silly, but we'll check with them just in case. If it is, and we hadn't checked, that would have been annoying. Hey, buddy, you, you interested in whatever the, the hell we, we did here? No? Okay. Well, at least take our trash off our hands. Okay. Nope, not him. But we'll take the heal. Oops. Take the heal, take the save, and then we'll be on our way. Guess that door we had opened earlier looks like, eh, maybe not boss door necessarily, but definitely the door of progress. Oh, maybe it is boss door, who knows? That's Malcomood? Okay, yeah, the the other mole people are just kind of like, yeah, no. Nah. They don't know what the fuck they're talking about. <laughs> Fucking neutral face Valera here. Probably one of my favorite portraits. Yeah, I kind of figured this was kind of a misunderstood type of thing going on. <laughs> ah, okay. And it's kind of kind of got goofy boss fight music to it as well. All right, oh, man. You know, either way, we could either 100% disrupt Salamander dude there, or we can. Somewhat disrupt Malcomood here. Um, I'm gonna go with that. Nice. Okay. Good read. Good read. Did we see this one before? Oh, oh, jeez. Um. Okay, good. Oh, 22s, though. Oof. 
I like that. Alright, Garl, you take one of these and go against this guy. 41, alright. Oh, hey, wait, 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 wait. Valer, you take the other one and you go against him. Okay, good read. Um, do we need to do big boy fireballs and shit on this? Probably not. But just in case, you know, we'll get ready to do one. Okay. Um... Garl, let us just keep on. Keep on, keep 40, damn, okay. Alright, you know what? No, we're gonna do a big boy fireball. I have a feeling that- oh, okay, you resist magic. I have a feeling that, uh, good old Malcomood here is not the big bad. <laughs> He's got way too goofy of a song to be the big bad here. Um, okay, I guess we're gonna moon stuff. Not a bad go. Uh, oh, whoa, jewel 40 is a pretty big go. Oh, whoops, sorry, Valer. <laughs> Doc crap. All right, just hang in there. We've got the party heal ready once you're back on your feet. Oh, okay, got a group attack there too, huh, buddy? All right. There we go. All right, you're, you're fine. Valeria, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Walk it off. I do like that automatic revive, though, and just survive a few turns. That's good shit. Good design. Oh, nice. I guess we did that. I don't know. Those look like smaller numbers. Alright, what do we got there? Moon stuff again? Okay, no problem. Just barely enough for moon stuff. Not bad. Okay, vulnerable to slash, it looks like. Got enough for a party heal again. I'm gonna leave the slash to powered slash to Zale then. Ah. Okay. Oh, well, we're near nearly to party heal again, anyways. All right. Um. Looks like that'll wait. <laughs> Oh, we don't have enough for Moonerang, though. Shit. Duh, nuts. Okay, maybe Party Heal will not wait. Alright, well, whatever. This is fully powered. It'll be fine. Oh, 54! <laughs> Forgot I was single target. My goodness. Oops. Sorry, uh... Sorry, right, Garl. It's gotta be getting close, though. Right? There we go. 
That's what we're looking for. We'll have party heal again in a moment. Ah, there we go. Doesn't matter. He's dead. Well, dead. <laughs> Beaten, defeated, knocked some sense into and or phase two or something. We didn't know. We left our village because we were magic and shit, right? Is Malcolm Mood gonna be a party member now? That would be pretty sick. Have you tried to dig? It's too boring! Yeah, there, okay. You know what? I'm with you, Malcolm Mood. I'm with you. Like, sometimes shit's just boring and you don't want to do it. That's right. The normal doesn't have to be your thing! Oh man, get that on a poster. Hey, okay, earth magic, blah blah blah. Try and do a good. Do a good instead. Do not do a bad. Only do a good. Stay in your fort, just don't block the wind, right? Like, that's the whole deal. Do not do a block of the wind. Also, Garl. Good guy, Garl. Fucking coming in. Coming in with the solutions. <laughs> See, alright, I fucking call it. Malcolm Mood was not a fucking bad mole. Bad wizard, whatever. Wraith Island, let's go take a ship, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Okay. We did it. Well, that's probably the first actual good big dungeon, right? We did it. Good progress. Oh, we get to look at the mysterious budget plague night ass whatever evils here. Ready for the eclipse and excited, okay. Sidekick's hesitance, huh? Okay. Alright, yeah, this is- well, this isn't the big bad, necessarily, but this is like the big bad's henchmen. The big bad's minions. Because we got, what, sword and shield, dual blades, I saw a staff in there, and then the other one was just, like, big. The other one was- had size. Alright, we did it! We talked to Malcomood, and it's- it's whatever. <laughs> Just fucking leave him alone. <laughs> yeah, exactly. There's something you didn't tell us about. You little shits. Yeah, fix the damn elevator. Or also give us a ship. Port Town of Brisk. Well, now we can get there, right? Yeah, okay. Excellent. Might even be a tavern? Oh yeah, now you're speaking my language there, Garl. Go get to that tavern. And also cargo up with Teeks again, I guess. Alright, let's have another look about the town here. Um... Preferably... <clears throat> finding a shop or something. Oh yeah, there it is! Did I just not go in that door, or was it closed? It might have been closed. I don't remember now. Well, either way. Um... Uh, bu -bu 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 what do you got? I've got all the shit that you have to sell. 
Except for this. What's this? Carries KO. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, there's our Phoenix down, right? Our life spell. Potatoes and onions. And it gives you, gets you up to 50 health. Alright, so if you can't afford to fucking wait around, just have a couple of those. Oh, wait, what do we got here? Insurers double hits on regular attacks. Chance of automatically timing blocks. Negates enemy defense bonus while casting. That's kind of sick. Oh, and there's uh, decreased damage taken. Alright, I mean, I'm not gonna... Probably won't turn on any of these, but... We'll have them, just in case, right? Because those are the relic bits. Yeah, look at that. Okay, cool. So you get extra little accessibility things as you go along. Guarantees extra hits for lock breaking, but reduces bonus damage from timing the hit by 50%. Okay, I see. 35% chance to block incoming attacks. Okay, I see. Removes the 20% damage resistance enemies have while casting. Blocks, okay. Reduce damage taken by 30%, just straight up, and then, yeah, okay. That's cool. That's a good way to do it. I mean, I might have preferred those available from the beginning, just by way of being truly accessible, but that's not a bad way to go about it. He didn't have anything else, right? No, we've already got all that. Okay, and now we've got the block moving bits, so we should be able to do... Where was that? Was it up here? Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay. Oh, I see. So those, the ones with the little conch shell blocks on them, give me rainbow conch shells. I get it. Okay, okay. I know there was definitely one on the, um, the little path area we took to get here, too. So we might go back for that. Not tonight, but we might. And there was a thing in here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's like, ah, oh, shit, I don't know what to do. I'm stuck in here or whatever. But yeah, now we'll do this. Because that'll activate the the water whatever, right? So that this uh, lady mole can take a bath and the mill is activated and all that. So we're doing a good. Doing a good all the way around. See, there you go. We did it. How much? What do we get? Oh, yeah. My rainbow conch for doing it. Okay. Very good. Okay, anything else around here that we can do before we... Probably save and call it a night, but before we ostensibly go, uh... Okay, I skipped through whatever he just said there. But ostensibly go on to the next area. Like, oh yeah, just wait a minute, and I'll go do- Oh, he's gonna open the path there! That's- Oh, that's cool! Okay, I'm into that. Super Mario Brothers 3-ass shortcuts going on, I get it. That's good. Sick. Alright. Into that. Okay, we got a full party heal for doing the boss thing, that's good. There's anything else around here, so we might be good to go. So we can just pop a save on the overworld here and then do the entrance here and then do the fishing bit when we come back. Oh, cool, and then Teex is with us at the campfire bits. Oh, right, we can learn about the, the thing from the cloak. Yeah, what do you got? The Great Summoning. What's up? What happened to the Great Summoning? Whoa, okay. Kanusniku. Kanusniku. Already been banished by the time the Great Summoning happened. 
It only had begun months prior, back when the lizard folk still had the upper hand. Toward the end of the decades long battle, after it became clear that the Moleskin, Molkin, excuse me, Molkin mages would be the victors, it's night and nights they are carried early cries of victory across the archipelago. Only the very sky tore open, and a giant sky serpent emerged to wreak havoc. Oh, it's probably the one curled around the mountain now, yeah? See, historians argue about the origins of the sky serpent. A monster of pure evil, stolen from another plane of existence, and forced to remain here, perhaps. I believe it came from above the clouds. Once friendly, mind corrupted, yada yada yada. Regardless of its origins, Sky Serpent was set to change the world forever. Back in the time of the Ovates, Ovates, whatever, their ritual of the elements could have been performed to control the Sky Serpent's mind. But alas, the Ovates were long gone. Earth magic being their only strength at hand, the Mulkin elementalists devised a plan to contain the threat. The little, you know, the flute through the mountain type thing, right? Wind tunnels straight through Extol's mountain, they turn into a giant musical instrument, and start playing melody so pure it forced the Sky Serpent into slumber. And she was strong, believed that the world would remain safe for generations. Or as long as the mountain played the melody true. So until the next earth slide or volcanic eruption or, you know, not really evil earth wizard. Greater good, the Mulkin gave up on their study of magic and established an output atop the mountain. Became <clears throat> expert miners, learned to keep the wind tunnels operational, yada yada yada. Uh, toiled around the clock ever since, protecting the world one pickaxe strike at a time. Centuries of stability, stories say the magic enchantment on the wind tunnels will eventually fade away. I only hope that the Ovates will return before that. Well, that's... I guess that's a good hope. I love that Garl's just stuffing his face every time we make a campfire. I'm into that. Like, I'm with him. I'm with him! I can definitely identify with the, the hungry boy type thing. Alright. Good progress tonight. I think with that we will... Call it a night. And return next time. Good game, Sea of Stars, so far. A very good game. Um, but that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CDT. It'll be Shmup Book Club. We'll have our new Shmup for month of October. Um, Death Smiles is still going, and then we also have a revisit of Blue Revolver coming up as well. Friday, Saturday, we're off. And then Sunday... You know what? We're gonna we're gonna take Sunday off as well. Uh, we got another thing starting on Sunday, um, not stream related, but something that I need to take care of. So we'll call Sunday off this time, and then resume next week Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, with more Sea of Stars. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.